Music licensing reimagined. Hey, what's going on, guys? Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Gone Fishing. Uh, it's a windy one today, guys, so uh, no fishing. But uh, I'll be getting all my walleye stuff ready, my musky stuff ready for a uh, couple more weeks. It should be uh, sh should be killer. Uh, I'd like to thank my new sponsor, MCI's. Uh, guys, he makes best baits. He's got jigs, he's got musky leaders, anything you need, guys. Uh, talk to Mike. I'll send you uh, the link of my new sponsor. And Mike, thanks a lot. I appreciate it. Uh, today will be a six month review of my fishing kayak. It is the Lost Creek Angler 12 slash Riot Mako 12. Right now it's just on the trailer under the tarp. Uh, I'll get the tarp off guys and uh, I'll show you what's up. All right guys, so here's my uh, setup. Like what I said, it's the Lost Creek Angler 12. It is 12 feet and a half long and three feet wide. Guys, it is very stable. You can stand up in it, fish, uh, big wakes. It goes through it like butter, guys. It is very, very stable. In the back, you got your router you got your lock you got your back storage very very nice you got your scupper plug in the back here you got a, your seat sit on top very very comfortable you got your steering you could put on each side you got two tracks on each side of the kayak and you can put your steering on either track it is awesome the steering i've heard a lot of complaints but uh, this one is perfect. You got a lot of uh, room underneath the seat for tackle boxes, <coughs> anything you want to put underneath. You got four scupper holes, two on each side. You got a water bottle holder. Comes with rod holder, very, very strong rod holder. I use it all the time and it is strong. You got your paddle holder right on the side by a bungee. That also holds tight. You got four rod holders. I decided not to use the rod holders. I built my own rod holder out of PVC pipe. Hold all my rods, my net. It is awesome. If you want to see the DIYs, guys, I got, uh, I got them on my other videos if you want to check them out. Then you got your pedal drive. Your forward and reverse pedal drive. It is awesome. Up front, you got another storage, huge storage. I got my battery inside, I got my first aid kit, everything. You got a scupper hole in the front. A lot of scupper holes, guys. If you're in a lot of wake and you got a lot of water in your kayak, this thing drains awesome. Up front, I got my milk crate with my GoPro that records the front of me. You got a lot of room up front. Very nice. I got my uh, navigation lights. I got blue lights under my seat for night. Let's go to the other side. Here I built my own uh, my own wheel trolley. Stays on the kayak all the time. If you guys want to check it out, like I said, it's on my other videos on my DIYs. Here I made my own anchor trolley. It's a scuba scuba diving uh, reel hooked up to an anchor with a two and a half pound weight. All you do is just 
you throw it down guys you open up your your reel and it goes down and i got my uh trolley system if you want to move it to the back or the front i got uh fish finder for lawrence and that's about it guys i bought a fold it fold fold half trailer for easy storage in the winter time it folds in half i got a couple four inch pvc pipes to unload and load this kayak guys it takes two seconds very easy to do so guys what i have to say about this kayak it is the best purchase i have ever purchased in my life this thing is a beast you can do any kind of fishing you want you want on it and it it, it holds up so guys that's the lost creek angler 12 slash riot mako 12 guys if you want to buy one they're less than uh 2000 american i paid 16.99 american came out to uh with everything 25 2600 canadian purchased the trailer so everything three grand and uh guys it, it will not disappoint you so uh here it is all right guys so that's my uh setup it's the lost creek angler 12 i love it uh, i've used it for about six months almost seven months and uh i have no bad things to say about this kayak it's a beast it, it's awesome i take it anywhere i take it lake st Clair, detroit river i took it out to lake erie it, it it it's awesome just guys make sure you watch the winds because it can get a little fishy out there and it doesn't matter what kayak you have it's it get dangerous so watch the winds and uh be careful uh, again, I'd like to thank my new sponsor, MCI's. Uh, thank you so much for the walleye baits, the jigs, and uh, thank you for the musky leaders. Guys, pretty soon I'll be going for uh, walleye, I'll be jigging for walleye, and I'll be trolling for musky. So stay tuned for those episodes. It's gonna be uh, it's gonna be awesome, uh, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Please subscribe, like, and share, and uh, stay tuned for the next one. Take care.